Wimbledon Broadcasting duo Sue Barker and John McEnroe have been criticized after they defended Boris Becker during the championships. Wimbledon commentary duo John McEnroe and Sue Barker were criticized on Monday after they declared their support for Boris Becker during the BBC's coverage of the SW19 Grand Slam. The three-time Wimbledon champion and former World No. 1 is serving a 30-month sentence at Humpuntercombe near Henley-on-Thames in Oxfordshire. Becker was found guilty of hiding £2.5 million of assets and loans to avoid paying debts. He was found guilty under the Insolvency Act and as the German is not a British citizen, he could be kicked out of the country once he is released. The charges include nine counts of failing to hand over coveted awards, seven of concealing property, five of failing to disclose estate, two of removal of property and one of concealing debt. Becker reportedly failed to hand over nine trophies, including two of his three Wimbledon men's singles titles, an Olympic gold medal, his 1991 and 1996 Australian Open trophies and his Davis Cup trophy and gold coin. The 54-year-old was part of the BBC's Wimbledon coverage last year, but he is now serving his two-and-a-half-year sentence. During coverage, McEnroe said, Boris, we love you. We miss you, man. Barker, who was leading the coverage for the BBC for the last time after 30 years, added, We do indeed. Viewers criticized the BBC for allowing the pair to send greetings to Becker, and it comes after McEnroe said last week he planned to visit the German in prison during the tournament. The American, who won Wimbledon on three occasions, said, Boris is a friend of mine. This is just horrible. I want to see him if I possibly can and if he's willing to see people. I just feel terrible. He's one of the great players that has ever played the game, and I know it meant a lot to Boris. He's been going through a lot for a long time. Viewers also criticized commentator Andrew Castle earlier this month after he declared his support for Becker during the BBC's coverage of the Queen's Club's Championships, the traditional warm-up tournament before Wimbledon. The 58-year-old said, I've had a real moment of missing Boris. I know he's in prison and I know why. Boris, we look forward to welcoming you on your return.